We're back with Black Lagoon's best girl, Ravy. Torita Minis made a pretty cool model for us to paint, so check them out after you watch the whole video at least five times. Gigi, why does my audio sound like I have a bucket on my head? I'll see what I can do about it, Jesse. Just leave it to old Gigi. Yeah, you do that. I don't even know why I hired you. Does anyone actually like these little segments? I'm just doing them because I think they're kind of funny. Just breaking up the routine. We like to have fun around here. You know what else is fun? VTubers. Seeing as I'm sort of one, I have an affinity for them. Snuffy is probably one of my favorites. And when I found out she had a model, well, I just couldn't help myself. Polybit's art captured her in her iconic orange outfit, and it just looks fantastic. We start off with the wrong color primer, since lighter colors don't really show up that well on black. I went over it with gray primer after this. For the logo on the base, it's easier to paint outside the lines and clean it up with black paint after the light colors. See? New primer color! I love this orange. I so rarely get a chance to use it. White scar isn't as bad as everyone says. You just have to shake the ever-living daylights out of it. Masking Putty for the win again. She has a very fine fishnet on this leg, and there was no way I could do that much cross hatching. So I went for a sheer legging instead by mixing one drop of black ink with four drops of transparent burnt sienna. If you're steady enough, you won't even need to mask parts off all the time. I used a lighter color on the hair to give a highlight effect on the top of her head.
The jacket logo took a while, but I would never make you guys sit through all that. Question for the painters in the audience. What do you have playing in the background while you work? It's Silent Hill ambiance music for me. This is actually the second time I did the lettering on the leg. I used panel line filler, but it just bled over the edges. Had to do it the old fashioned way instead. I've never done proper anime eyes before. Gotta work on that a little more. All right, let's see how we did.
Big shout out to my friend on Patreon, Wesley Taylor. If you want to help the channel, you can find me on Patreon. Check out my socials and the links on the channel page and check out Polybit's art for all their awesome models. Stay tuned for the preview and we'll see you next time.